we have it. At least I can see that it works for me now. And this one should be reduced in size. No, ah, whatever. This is the important one. Uh, sound might be a bit messed up now since I made it much higher. Game Audio, awesome! Um, I will lower the volume, just make sure. Like this. Tell me, if, tell me if everything is fine. Um, Adminius Paul, hi, I'm new, and you are very much welcome. Welcome to my stream where we first have some problems. Either the sound doesn't work or the mic is broken, and then we get into the game. So yeah, welcome, and we will continue this salty expansion of my salt empire. Alright, um, so our plans is to wait until the truce with Switzerland and take the two lost provinces from them and then with the help of France, kill Venice and finally increase our salt amount. It's been quite a while since we last saw an expansion. And why are you working there? Cancel it, improve it, yes. Seems good, might increase it a tiny bit. Okay, then I will increase it a tiny bit. Actually, let's do it here. That should be better now. Like, I don't want to skip this awesome music. And I don't want to betray, uh, take it from you. So, I need to fix it. So, we're just rolling, alo uh, rolling along now. And uh, she's acting. Oh! Why are we losing so much money? Does anyone take attrition? No. My pirates are taking la taking or taking some gold, I think. So it might just be that. Oh right, corruption. We're rooting out all the corruption from our overextension. Oh, this is so much nicer. I can sit back, I can relax, and not worry about any stupid Mega Man units jumping or puzzling. Oh god, that was horrible. It took me 3 hours and 40 minutes to play through the first game. They seem to be going fine now. Do we have any revolts anyway? Yes, we have l lots of revolts actually. Or maybe soon to be revolts. How come? Okay, there's two provinces. I will let your army stand there and I will send up you two to that provinces. Alright, we took both of them quite quickly. And uh, one thing I no just noticed was we have now blocked off Europe. We control the north, we control the south. So everyone who wants to attack someone on the east side needs to go pass go through us. Damn shame that we can like force them to pay up for their military access. Like, oh you want to move through? Give me 40 ducats. Better thanks. Awesome. Like if I'm gonna stream this, I need to do it as good as possible for you. How did you manage to <laughs> get so stretched out territories? <laughs> Well, I was going for salty provinces, so it started by Saltburg, so I went up a little bit. Then I noticed the golden salt here, so I went up to take that one. Then I noticed all these salty provinces, so I went up more. And the same thing here, basically. I saw this salty province, and I thought, oh, some salt provinces over here, let's take them. 
And of course, why did I go west? So we have this actually like boot. Yeah, we have a boot. Yeah, because it's all the province here. But I think France will take it. And since they're my very trusted allies now, they're free to do so. I bet Daniel's closet is full of <laughs> salt. <laughs> yeah. No, it's actually a toilet paper, if I remember correctly. Yeah, or oh, remember correctly, if I know. It is toilet paper. Uh, gold and salt looks awesome. It is awesome. It brings me all this gold, then salt. But my inflation has been terrible for quite a while. I actually had to reduce it from like plus 11 or something. <laughs> Hello from Texas, Daniel. Oh, cool. Yeah, may maybe we should do a head count again. I did that during my first stream, like, where do you all come from? So, um, if you would like, write where you come from, so we can see where everyone is from. I said that like three times, but yeah. That would be awesome. It's the second European boot with <laughs> Italy, yeah. So we had two boots. Uh, let's increase American list a bit by 300. Yeah. So we have UK, we have Texas, we have Sweden or Texas. I know it's not a country, but United States, UK, Sweden, Germany, Sweden, Australia, Finland, Stockholm as your local. Living in Sweden, but from Fran France, UK. So, you swam in the water, in between them. Germany. This is so cool, really. We have people from all, of, all around the world, really. Germany. Ukraine, too. Oof. It, it would really have, like, a good mix in Europe. A couple from my northern Scandinavian countries and quite a lot from the US. Cool. Norway, Poland. Born in UK, but France, have France, have family in France and lived there for 18 years. And Denmark. Yearly inflation. <laughs> I'm, I, I'm mistaken, all inflation guys. This is so cool. Sabaretas, thank you for the follow. <laughs> oh, we're actually losing inflation now. This is so good. Finally, we arrived at that point. I just had these two golden... Uh, these two golden provinces really early when it was basically this big and it completely ruined my inflation uh, ah did you only take the salt province it's quite sad that these two I will take them later but for now France is my dear dear ally uh, hmm 15 prestige or go yeah 15 prestige uh, minus one gain explorer with five tradition I don't want to lose prestige, but you want to pay 100 for it. Yeah, sure. <laughs> then he's firing him right away. Are you a disappointing world marriage between. Disappointing world marriage between France, England, UK, Kuttelberg? Or do you still have a claim on the UK realms? I don't think I have a claim on the UK realms. I was allied with Poland before, if that is what you remember. Muscovy, you kind of like me. Let's improve the last bit of relationship there. I kept the claim. Okay, elite boy. Oh, you're talking with someone else. <laughs> oh, right. You lived everywhere. So confused for a second. So, we, we need really need to refill our manpower. It was really drained since in last session, 
we had the 30 years or not 30 years war the religious league war league war and uh, yeah i joined the catholic side because they had france and poland but france and poland was in war so when the league fired both france and poland said no but still somehow we won over the protestant which is kind of bad since i'm protestant but fine it really wouldn't matter much but um Yes, yeah, so we fought for the Catholic side, we won, and Austria actually gave us two provinces down here. So that was pretty great. But before that, the manpower had been drained because Teutonic Order was forced released from Poland, and I took two provinces from them. No, three provinces from them. Um, yeah, that's why we're like this currently. <laughs> Okay, Switzerland, do you have anything more I can claim on? No, so I will remove you and I will improve the relationship with Hungary if I can. Yeah, I can, I definitely can do by 45. And revol revolt should soon fire. Can I reduce the inflation? Oh, yeah, make it into a state. Have I made you into states? Yeah. So is that. No, this is two states, unfortunately. Yes, I'm not 100% sure if I should really do this right now, maybe sh probably shouldn't, but ju just so I don't forget it, or something. And now, we're, now we will just stay and wait until we can upgrade admin IDs, I don't, I don't want to get behind in tech for that. I will maybe support you in this case, BBB is coming. Holy Salt Empire is the best. The best, the only empire is the Salty Empire. Hi Daniel. Oh, hi. Raiki. Sorry for slaughtering your name, but hello. <laughs> Let's see, can we build anything anywhere? Yeah, we can. Oh, here. It's kind of worth it not really but uh, good enough and local sailor modifier it's fine for now trade no thank you yeah we can't really build anything so it will just be oh, we could build them oh naval requires naval supplies fish or salt and why can't we build them here we need a building slot open so let's see you have 40 developments so you just gained no no you have seven oh, what am i saying okay i'm ahead of time in military tech i don't have anything else to spend it on it's not a super good province to do it in but i will do it three times so we can build a manufacturer that will increase our salt boom And land salt, you have 12, just kind of, here's four. Oh god, it's super expensive, I just realized. Uh, let's do it anyway. And increase, oh, we don't have enough money for it. Um, yeah, let's just wait. Do you know the next topic for the dev diary in Hoi4? Actually, I do. It's one of the rare opportunities when I actually know what's going on to happen. Should I tell you guys? Hmm. I don't know. It, it, it's something special to say, at least. Not something like really amazing, but it, I actually have something to do with it. Yeah, that, that, that's that's the tip I'll do. I will actually write something in the next dev diary. And I think... Oh god, someone is calling me. I'm sorry, I can't take you right now since I'm streaming. But I will send you a message. I will call you as soon as I'm done. So sorry for this. Um, yes. Salt is salt. Salt is salt. Like, it, this feels so good right now. It's really relaxing from three hours of Mega Man. <laughs> no, almost four. Oh. 
How, how, how are you all doing this fine Saturday evening? Or evening? Midday? You're all over the world. How are you doing this fine Saturday? I, I had a stressful morning with a lot of salt and bitterness. I will upload it on YouTube later, so if you want to see it, you can see it. I'm just salting like hell. Someone even said I've never been that salty since the EU4 multiplayer at the office, so yeah, that was kind of a lot. Um, yeah. Fi uh, finding salt gives you research bonus for nukes. <laughs> Oof, that would be really cool. And something I want to add. Is spreading out the poison over the whole world. Um, so I'm sorry, I, I don't know Russian, so I can't answer you. Uh, somewhere here was a salty province that wanted some manufacturing. Oh, wait, I need... 15 more. Give me it now. Ah, yes, be safe. Here. Oh, it was in Salzburg. So, yeah, we increased our salt amount. One way or the other. Right, how many years? I think it was three more years. Yes. Discovery spread. Yeah, we can. Let's see how the colonizing is doing. So France is still kind of stuck in exactly the same place they were before. And Castile is really expanding quite a lot in Mexico. And Portugal is still kind of the same as last time we looked. Oh, we seem to have a, a, a large Adal empire. Holy crap. Kilwa seems also pretty big. The Ottomans are expanding actually to the east instead of west. Mamluks. Or they have taken some from them. They had a really slow start, Ottomans, but they are finally doing something. Which is kind of bad for me since I'm most likely going to war with them sooner or later. Salt. Yellow salt and more salt. Why Salzburg? Not Salzburg again. Oh! That's very true. I have no clue actually. Thank you for spotting that. Salzburg. What the hell? Salzburg. Land salt. Saltbach. Uh, so it was some some place more. No, it wasn't. It was those. That was super weird. Good find. All right, Muscovy requesting to come to their aid in Muscovy to con reconquest Kaluga, Poland, Pomerania. This war is they have started. Poland is allied with France. God damn it, Moscow. Why? Why did you do it now? We need to wait until Poland's alliance with France has ended. So yeah, I, I'd rather keep France and I don't want to be in two front war along with Moscow. No, thank you. And they're allied with Ottomans. And Ottomans also betray them. So it's only Ottomans versus Poland and France. And Pomerania. Pomerania is being annexed by Poland. Oh, are they? Yeah. Okay. That, that will still be the same. Hopefully the Muscovy wins this war so they can force them to stop it or something. Um, we had some revolt, a revolt down here so let's just send in the other army. It's not really needed but few losses is always good to have. And France will join them. Actually, if we're not, uh, let's do like this. 
I will just try to improve this to 100 as quickly as possible to get the achievement and because it's good then I will focus more on admin tech uh, yeah die Pomerania, uh, no, I read that. He's asking if there's any Russian in sh Russians in the chat. <laughs> Keep it to English, please. I don't want to force everyone to stay in English, but... It feels a bit weird if... At least I can't understand everything. If you do a message too, it's fine. Just... And I'm all for people speaking different languages, since the same that's the same reason why I don't want any, everyone to speak in Swedish here. Since most of the other people won't understand. English is, is a good language that a lot of people knows. That a lot of people know. So I will try to, try to stick to English. Studying for physics exam. <laughs> well, uh, you're not doing a very well job if you're watching my stream. I approve of it. Just pour a bit of salt in a bag and send it in. Like they said, you need math, physics, biology and all that in the adult life. Yeah, I also need to know how to best annex Austria. And that is even of more help than my math exams in my current line of work. Oh, we have one territory. Uh, can't I spell or something? Oh, right, I forgot to turn off dynamic names. Maybe I can change it here. Nope. God damn it. Yeah, I'm gonna turn it off until next time. I don't wanna miss anything. Um, probably something in my new newly conquered area. Yeah, here. Make it a state. Make them course. And now we wait for even a longer time. Hmm. Some sun seems to be shining in now. If it doesn't abrupt... No, it still looks kind of good. If it becomes worse, I will close the windows. <sighs> Two more years. Or, yeah, exactly two more years. No, not exactly. Two more years soon, exactly. Two more years, exactly. Boom. Told you. <laughs> Do we have any more revolts than just them? Um, we have some in Newmark. Everything is fine. Some over here. So let's actually move that arm over here. Or you are yellow. The water ones are only light green. So you guys move up there. We have one lady too much, but both of them are pretty good, so I'm fine with it. Okay, can, can the revolts like just fire a bit quickly? I want to turn down all the army maintenance so I can start earning some money. So I can pay off fronts when I finally need them. Uh, I don't know if I need this fort anymore. Uh, let's keep it for now, actually. If we attack Austria one more time. Yeah, they are also Emperor. But he doesn't get that much of a bonus anymore. Because all the Protestant left. Protestants left. 
And now... Oh yeah, I removed it. Daniel, what's your max manpower? It's currently on 62,000. So just making these, this two to a state and this one to a state increase my manpower by 4,000. So it's quite impressive. Oh, of course, I core them also. Right, we're going to stomp. I can't reduce autonomy. I can reduce autonomy here. But you don't have any unrest anymore. You have a 0 0.5. Hmm. Oh, I think I will keep you right there until they are a bit more happy about me. Let's speed it up. Oh, wait, I haven't seen you. Oh, that's just Castillo. <laughs> and here, of course, but... Castillo got the uh, Bur Burgundian inheritance. And, oh, I almost boarded the Ottomans. And they really like me. But they rivaled with France. I don't want to lose France yet. Let's increase the trust one time. But let's keep good relationships with Ottomans. For now. Since I don't really have anything else to do with my diplomats. So I had to fix something off screen. Um, all right. Um, no, don't pick ID. Oh, don't pick ID. Wait for this. <laughs> How much development do you have? My current development is at four hundred and thirty-seven. So yeah, I'm a regular member of the HRE, so I can't improve it, but. When I get 500, I will just leave the HRE, so I can become a kingdom. Uh, when I have 50 prestige, I will just leave it. Uh, let's increase base tax there. <coughs> Sorry about that. Come on. Actually, how is the salt quest going currently? Trade, uh, trade goods. No. Here. Salt. Top is Ottomans. We have 4.9%. Okay. We're quite a lot behind. Unfortunately. But we will, we will grab the salt promises. One after one. Even if it takes the whole game. Which is the game's point. Switzerland is guaranteed by Castile and warned by Castile. What other other games except Paradox games do you play in your free time? Well, I apparently play Mega Man for four hours. Um, I like roguelikes. I play some Total War. I play some Counter Strike Go. Also. Um, most ki most kinds of games, really. There's very few games I or game types I don't play. So it's actually the only games I don't play is like Facebook games, those kinds of ones. Just timers waiting to tick out while you do something, and. Uh, Dress up games. I'm not a big fan of those either. But pretty much anything else. I'm a DMG in Counter Strike, so uh, decent, not super good. I'm good enough to play with my friends. Kind of. They're better than me. 
but they helped me.